if you guys are wondering what the achievements are, uh, tough. I guess you could Google it, I don't know. Oh, oh. Oh, that's a miss. Phew. So that is just an obscene amount of baddies. So, um, I think we need to use the frag cannon. Start blowing some of these fools up. Let's use a frag cannon. Uh, I'll aim for, I guess, them. Good stuff. Very the useful against gene stealers. Serves the will of the chapter. Yeah, as it should. I'm assuming. It'd be weird for him to show off about it otherwise. When the day is darkest, we prevail through control. And... Not bad, not bad. You can keep going, though. My chainsaw thirsts for their blood. <laughs> well, that suits me fine. Excellent. Uh, and now I'm going to flank this unit. And sort him up fun time. Good job, sis. I am the instrument of his divine will. Excellent. That's what I like to hear. Good job. Let's get the librarian in as well. So, do you deal with those termagants? Uh, nah, we're not there yet. Oh, you haven't shot yet either. That's good news. Alright, let's go for the gene stealers. Very nicely done. Start shooting these termagants again. Uh, I can get into melee with these guys. I'm not sure if that's something I want to do, but it is something I'm probably going to do. As you should. Uh, so the frag cannon. The combined damage of all of that would actually be pretty good. You know, it would actually do quite a good job against these guys, I think. Past, future, there is only service to the Emperor. So, uh, although I probably should save that, shouldn't I? For crowds of stuff. I mean, there's no way these guys are going to survive, is there? Yeah, let's just see if we can get a shot up. Should kill one. Nice. And, yeah, let's just butcher the next two. My vigilance is eternal. Horse halberd. <laughs> Killed them both immediately. Excellent. I do like a good force halberd. Uh, Alright, you start shooting them. You start pushing up. You guys do the same. Hell blasters. Uh, not bad odds to hit, actually. And again, not bad odds from here either. It's not going to do too much damage, I don't think. That's pretty good. Uh, and again, not terrible odds considering the distance, so. May as well give it a try. Getting the odd crit as well, which is nice to see. So yeah, if we can get something in from, uh,. Oh god, you haven't... Ah. Could you have done anything? Nah, you can only put up armor. Can't really do anything else. Um, let's just push you up one and you can overwatch. Oh, hello. I forgot you existed. Sorry, guys. <laughs> My bad. I guess, uh... I guess I'll just sprint them up this way. That's very amusing to me. Alright, so you're not going to reach, obviously, but you can overwatch badly. And I could try and shoot them, but I'm not going to. That would be silly. Oops. I'm going to move them a bit further, actually. Death from above. Uh, how am I going to kill the these guys? That's what I want to know. Guns. They always say that. Always. Always we'll say that. Upon them with righteous fury. I'm sure you will. You know what they remind me of, actually, when they're in motion? It's, it's Sonic. They move like Sonic. That's what it is. They all move like Sonic. And it's amazing. <laughs> but like, you know, when he's when he's obviously in supersonic mode. Not regular Sonic, because that would just be a ball. You know? That would just be a a um a a oblate spheroid. But they don't move like an oblate spheroid. Don't be ridiculous, guys. You know what, can you actually get in range of him? I don't know if he can shoot from there. We can handle it. I mean, only if you can see him. Fire support. Something tells me you can't handle it, mate. Actually, 44% chance to hit. 
So yeah, we can shoot through here. That's fine. Nope, that's full cover. What? <laughs> All right, fine. Be that way. All right, you can just shoot them. That's fine. Oh, Sister Verity and the Librarian aren't done yet. Oh, well, that's embarrassing, isn't it? Never mind. You can move up a bit more. And I guess Carleon can just start shooting stuff. Heavy fire support. Mm, yeah, all right. Let's get them with the Bolt Storm Gauntlet. Let's start punching Shoot. Tyranids. Crush it. Either way, it dies by nice. My Good job, boys. And 6% chance to hit these guys. I will take it. So the Exocrine did survive, sadly. That's okay. That's okay. We have done some very, very good damage to everything. And in fact, there's still a lot of territory to move, like... I was going to say push and move through. Like one or the other. It, I almost said mush. There's a lot more territory to mush through. If I had a bunch of huskies, maybe that would be more appropriate. But I don't. Um, anyway, there's still 12 enemies, so... There's clearly, resistance. clearly still quite a lot of stuff knocking around back there. Ouch. Yeah, you really were. You really were, mate. How's this guy gonna do? It'd be so funny if Sister Verity killed him from a distance. Not quite. Real close, though. Well. Oh, shoot the tank. Fine. Shoot the tank. Shoot the thing that can tank all of the damage. Like, it's called a tank. It shouldn't be a surprise that that's not something worth shooting. Like, when you're being swarmed by enemies, you know? I'd brother Quindar. I don't really care if you use your action points, too. I just want to move everyone up at this point. And you. And you. Alright. Let's start blatting these guys, too. Although that won't quite do the job, will it? Nah, stop with the Inceptors. I will not fail. Ready to okay, good. Now, punch him to death. Bam. Oh, you missed! You lemon. The librarian can assist you in this matter if it must. Uh, it must. Uh, so the librarian can't actually heal, which is a bit sad. But he can attack him with a sword. So I suppose that's something. Heavy fire support! Uh, where is... I am the sword of Sanguinius. Oh, there he is. There's Brother Otero. Alright, you move up. Otero, you get in the bloodbath. Good boy. Ready to strike. And you guys can move Antonio right up. With you. Okay, the heal those Inceptors, please. Do not falter. And I think everyone's just going to overwatch. Oh, hang on a minute. Move you forward. Another square, might as well. See what I mean? They move like supersonic. Forever watching. Forever watching supersonic. Oh, I never did actually kill him. That's embarrassing. Ah, uh, yeah. More Tyranid Warriors. One's dead already. Hell of an Overwatch. Well done, mate. Well done. And yeah, that's just it's nothing. Doesn't matter. We're good. Okay, something else over here, huh? Yeah, more Tyranid Warriors. Yeah, this guy's gonna move in. It's okay. It's only one. Also, ow! There we go. Finally got that kill. So yeah, still ten left. Seems to be mostly Tyranid Warriors. Making a wall. <laughs> Just using the corpses of their brethren as a wall. Against incoming fire. That's such a Tyranid thing to do, isn't it? Oh, they don't care how many of them have fallen. Doesn't bother them one bit. Sister Verity with the ludicrous long shot again. Actually managed to kill a couple of them. Nice. God. Hell blasters shooting from a mile away. Except getting some kills. Yeah, that was never going to hit, was it? Nice one. Good job, Supersonic. Proud of you. Am I going to try and kill that single Termagant with the, the giant Melter Cannon? Victory I think I'm probably going to, yeah. Yeah, I think... 
I think that's a, a near certainty at this point. Destination confirmed. <laughs> Destination confirmed. Make it so. Waiting to launch. Inceptors waiting for lunch. Out of range, huh? May as well move a bit My further forward then. Uh, yeah, 51% chance to shoot as well. Understood. Understood. We can handle it. I could have actually tried to shoot with them, I think. I was thinking they're more inceptors. My bad. By. My bad. Alright, might as well give someone armor, huh? May as well be the Furiosa Dreadnought. And... Yeah, you try and shoot again, that's fine. We're going to have the uh, Inceptor's Jump Jet over here, I think. Now, there's only ten left. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We are seeing most of them already, so... Let's get you up there. Alright, 55% chance to hit. Let's see if we can increase those odds. Oh, yeah, more Termagants, yeah. Oh, and more Gene Stealers. Yeah, there's nothing. A Thornback? Ugh. Useless. Who cares about that? Alright, let's see if we can get him. Hell yeah. Worth it. Worth it. Alright, let's get you right up in there. And... Let's see. I can get another shot with this guy. And it'd be rude not to, wouldn't it? Yes, it would. A few grazes in there, but another 100 damage. Sounds rather nice to me. Uh, yeah, let's try and get some damage into that lot. And I can jump over here. That It doesn't even look like they're jump jetting. Well, that's probably going to sting a bit. It doesn't look like they're jump jetting, if I'm honest. I, I can't even tell. Okay, good. Nice. That's what I like to see. Uh, now, is there any way that I can get Hellblast close enough to even get a shot off? Probably not. I'm sure Sister Verity can shoot from there, though. <laughs> she just... Oh, she can shoot. Yeah, look at that. Get it, Verity. All right, five damage. This this is the one though. This is the one. I mean, I he might have had a mewling tantrum, but I don't think you got him. Sorry. Uh, I mean, you can't really do anything. Let's move you forward again. Uh. I guess I'll move here. Might be able to reach them. If not, at least I'm closer, I suppose. I'll give that a go. Carleon can move up, I suppose. Uh, I could actually jump jet over to here. I'm actually tempted, but he will get absolutely um, torn two shreds, so maybe that's not a good idea. I'll jump him in next turn, though. Sounds fun to me. Oh, we've got aggressors over here as well. You guys can move up too. And, okay, I can shoot at these guys. So I guess I'll give it a go. Might as well, eh? And you lot can't shoot anything, but I guess I could set up an overwatch. Ish. Alright, that'll do. Um, oh, hang on. Oh, I can shoot these guys. Not going to do much, I'm sure, but... Oh, we did kill one? Killed two? Nope, didn't kill any. They just got knocked over. Never mind. Alright, that'll do. Overwatch confirm. Now we'll see what ludicrous overwatches we managed to accomplish. Again, shooting at the tank. The thing that can that can tank damage. Because it's a tank. Oh, nice. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks for that. Tyranids just not caring. Ooh, another thorn back coming in. Grazes there, but some alright damage there. Yeah, not terrible. Not terrible. Pretty good. Pretty good. That, not so great. But I'm sure it rattled him. That's what matters. And really, he shot over there. I mean, at least they're not wasting their time shooting at our dreadnoughts. Never mind. Spoke too soon. Sweet. Yeah, we're getting some damage in here. <laughs> the librarian's having a go. There's only seven left, so... 
No. Yeah. I noticed. Yep. Oh, good. This could actually do a lot of damage. Yeah, that's actually not as great as I thought it would be, actually. For the enemies, I mean. It's fine for us. We, we're still just... It's like water off a camel's back, whatever that means. You guys are fine, stop complaining. Good, my turn again. In that case... Oh, I can't jump pack. Carleon's already jump packed recently. That's very disappointing. I was hoping to jump pack over here. Uh, I accidentally jump packed to there, didn't I? When I was considering going over there, I bet. That's the sort of thing I tend to do. Right. You guys can jump pack, though. Uh, let's move you up so you're a little bit more accurate. Here we go. Uh, hopefully you can finish them off. And 65% chance to hit. Tell you what, I'm going to overwatch because I don't think... Not overwatch, supercharge because I don't think that's going to make much of a difference. And didn't quite get the kill, but that's okay. Let's see if we can't get this thorn back with the big gun. So 65% chance to hit. Nice. I'm enjoying these guns. They're very satisfying to use. Yeah, you could just cut him up. Nice. And now let's move you further up. And finish that guy off too. Alright, not terrible. You go for him. Now let's use this big gun. <laughs> nice. Heavy close support. And, oh, they all died. Okay. Yeah, I think it's just him left. Him meaning that group of many things. Okay. Up the accuracy. And let's supercharge, even though I might actually kill one of these guys, I think. Yeah, one died. <laughs> oh, awkward. Alright, you start shooting, because you can. Oh, was that was it? That was it. Alright, you did your business. You haven't yet, so I guess uh, you can get into a better position. Sister Verity. Can't shoot there. Full cover. That won't do. Yeah, you can start shooting. This will probably finish off the mission, actually. Yeah, there the we go. The flow of Xenos has been slow. We have completed the work of the Unredeemed. And yet it was not just the alien that debased themselves. Those soldiers. There may be little humanity left in you space marines, but those men were perversions in the eyes of the Emperor. Were it not for them, your mission would have been overrun days ago. Those tireless warriors were the only thing holding the Tyranids back from Angel's Fall. The respite is temporary. A cluster of aberrations awaits us at the canyon's end. Resolution is inevitable. Seems we may have found their hive, huh? Pretty cool. I also like the uh, increased tension. The fact that there's, you know, a different chapter here that knows nothing of uh, of the, the nonsense that the, the Blood Angels have to deal with. You know, the crazy um, bloodthirst or whatever. So, kind of cool. I like that, you know. Potential... Uh, sort of, uh, I guess, diplomatic rift? Is that a sentence that makes any sense? You know what I mean. It could cause some tension between allies, uh, knowing that that's what, sort of, the Blood Angels will eventually become. It doesn't really sort of give you the best kind of peace of mind, you know, fighting alongside them. Anyway, let us proceed. Alright, deployment capacity upgraded, apparently. And we did get new units, though I'm not sure I'm going to bother with either of them, if I'm honest. Uh, I'm not even sure if I'm going to bother with our librarian anymore. He's a bit rubbish. And okay, and now a bunch of stuff has disappeared again. I really wish this wouldn't happen. They're just all in my reserves again. Like, why aren't they just in here? Like, wouldn't that be good? I think that would be great. So, where are they? It's all you lot, isn't it? It's that. 
Should we get more of them? Don't know. What else have we got? We've got a lot of random stuff in reserves. I'm almost tempted at this point to actually swap out my aggressors, even though they've been here pretty much forever, not that I think this makes any difference whatsoever, uh, swap them out for some more land speeders. Uh, well, for some land speeders, so we can get a few of them, because they were quite cool, the land speeders with the with the machine guns. Um, or maybe just more dreadnoughts. Well, just more intercessors, maybe. Inceptors, rather. Because inceptors are kind of awesome. Yeah, they do a bunch of damage. Good armor piercing. And we also have these Furiosa Dreadnoughts from earlier that we could bring back into the fold. One of them was there for five missions. One of these in reserves has never even turned up, and yet these in my reserves. Like, what the hell? It's just ridiculous. So bizarre. I just don't understand why stuff keeps ending up here. But, oh well. Let's get more of you. And... Is that what I want? Five Inceptors, two... Um, to basically everything else. He had three Hellblasters. Don't need the Librarian. He's a bit rubbish. Uh, I just don't see the point of him. I mean, he attacked something with a sword at one point, but I feel we get way more utility out of pretty much everything. So yeah, let's bring these guys in. Let's bring these guys in. So I get rid of one of the Inceptors. So do you want the Plasma Guns? Do you have an Assault Bolter? Let's put that to the Plasma Exterminator. Good. And yeah, you've all got that. And let's bring you in. Cool. So this this feels a bit more um, varied, a bit more fun, I think. Cool. But yeah, I don't know about the aggressors. I do quite like their abilities, but they seem to be lagging behind most of my units right now. So I'm not sure. Not sure about it. Hmm. Dunno. Also, for the spectacles, things I was using the melter guns, I'm going to go all in with the big uh, damage figures. Even though, as I have said, you know, a couple times now, I like uh, the reliability. Uh, at the moment, I honestly don't care if we miss or not. We're just not losing any troops anyway, so I may as well live on the edge. If we get, like, big burst damage, we can go, ooh, and it's just more more exciting. So I think that'll do. Um, I think that's everything then. I still just don't know about these aggressors, though. We've had them for so long, and they are ruddy useful, really versatile, but... Yeah, I think I think we'll we'll keep them. We'll keep them. They're just they've been a part of our army the whole time. It would be weird to get rid of them. So we're done there and HQ upgrades. Let's have a look. So I still haven't bothered to use the assault cannon at all. I keep forgetting to use these command abilities. Um, it's just not obvious enough. So we'll get the frag grenade. Although I'm not sure any of our units can even use these yet. Well, any more rather. In which case, I won't bother. <laughs> That's only for the assault squads. Alright, let's have a look at somebody else. Flamestorm Gauntlet for the aggressors. That could be interesting. That would change things up a bit. And might be better for uh, for dealing with, like, just, you know, hordes of, like, Termigans and Helmigans. That could be fun. Uh, extra melee damage for aggressors there as well. Brother Altero can give 40 momentum. Extra armor piercing damage in melee for all HQ units, which is pretty cool. Um, HQ units get plus 20 HP per model. All Blood Angels get plus 20 HP per model. That's kind of insane. And Uncanny Senses is ranged armor piercing for Hellblasters. Okay, I like Ortero's style. The day is darkest, Let's go with all of that nonsense. Through control. Cool, so we got all that and we still have six points left. That's crazy. Oh, did I already have that one? I think I already had that one. I think I did that last episode, too. Anyway, uh... Alright, let's have a look. What else we got? Invoke the Machine Spirit. Ooh, Flamestorm Cannons for the Bile Predator. Could try that. Could try that. Uh, or the Multi Melter. Who's that for? For the Land Speeder. Oh. Oh, that's the Standard Land Speeder. And this one is for the Tornado. That's a bit upsetting, because <laughs> we've just got the tornadoes right now. Let's get the flamestorm cannon for the for the Yet bile the predator. My axe couldn't bisect. Well, I'm proud of them. So army management. So what will that that replaces the twin assault cannons, which is a real pity because the twin assault cannons are 
brutally effective. They've been doing like 100 damage to even, you know, really heavily armored stuff, which is pretty great. But setting everything on fire sounds like a hell of a laugh, so let's do that. Okay, let's do it. Let's mix things up. Cool. And, yep, the heavy bolter and the assault cannon is all they're getting. Alright, I think that's it then. We're all set for, uh, hang on, power sword. That is the best one, yep. Just want to check I haven't ignored anything on these guys. Thunder hammer is the best he's got. And these guys haven't got any upgrades yet. Fine. Alright, that's going to be it for today then. The next up is Angel's Leap. So, guys, if you've enjoyed this, comment, like, subscribe, and uh, be sure to take the leap. And join us for tomorrow's episode. See? See how clever that was? I'm clever. Subscribe for more. Laters.